All right, folks, we are live this Wednesday, June 24th, 2009. You know, I said Monday yesterday. I was just realizing that on the way home. I was totally out of it. Covered so much news yesterday and only going to cover more today. The call line is 866-582-9933. And I want to start it off with the cop who beat the young woman, the bartender, uh, you know, the off-duty lord, the god. We have this over at the InfoWarrior.com right now. Just beat her silly. I mean, beat her worse than any man should ever beat a woman. And a man should never beat a woman. But, I mean, we're talking, we're watching it right now on the TV. This is somewhat into it. He's throwing haymakers to her face. Facial haymakers. Boom, 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 boom. Left uppercut, right hook. You better believe this is a big guy. Looks like state, uh, or uh, what is it, Haystacks Calhoun out of the 70s. Anyhow, uh, the guy didn't get any jail time. Zero jail time. No jail time whatsoever. I mean, didn't get anything. Uh, I mean, he could have got up to five years, by the way, folks. Uh, this was not, I mean, this was a serious assault. This was Assault Town, USA. A Chicago police officer was sentenced to two years probation Tuesday for pummeling a woman who was tending bar, even though prosecutors produced a previously unseen video showing him beating someone else at the bar hours earlier. He didn't just put the hurting on the woman. He's a tough guy cop. He beat up some other poor, defenseless Innocent guy. Anthony Abate, or Abate, who declined to say anything to the judge before he was sentenced, could have gotten up to five years for beating Carolina Obrica in February of 2007. We're going to play the whole news clip on the other side of this. The attack was captured by the bar security camera, and the video was shown around the world. Yes, it was a vi viral video for quite some time. If I believed that sending Anthony Abate to prison would stop people from getting drunk and hitting other people, I'd sentence him to the maximum, the judge said. But I don't believe that to be the case. What kind of flawed logic is that, ladies and gentlemen? Let's think about that. So what they're trying to say is that since uh, this isn't going to save the world and make it a better place, then we're not going to punish him to the fullest extent of the law. By that, you shouldn't punish uh, murderers to the fullest extent of the law, because it's not going to stop murder, is it? I mean, you put a murderer in jail, someone else is going to murder someone else. So just because you put this guy in jail, yeah, you're not going to stop people from getting drunk and hitting other people. But you might make, you know, the Lord cops out there think twice about getting hammered and beating up a woman. I mean, he beat this woman we're going to just play the whole clip on the other side. Those listening, you should get the picture. Those watching PrisonPlanet.tv who haven't seen this before, your jaws should be on the ground wide open. This guy is throwing bombs. He's probably got hams for hands. I mean, he's a big dude. He's in... I mean, this guy looks like... I don't even know how to describe it. He... he He's, he's got to be 200 plus pounds. The woman he's beating is probably like 120, 130 tops. And he's not just pushing her and saying, I want a drink. He's pinning her down. And he is one, two, three, left. One, two, left, left. And you know what's really disgusting? The cowardice of the other patrons at the bar. What are they doing? They're hauling back. They're just calling the, they're calling the officers. Ooh, they can't step in. Don't step in against a cop. Oh, no. doesn't matter. He's beating a woman. Unbelievable. We're going to play the clip on the other side and go through so much more. 866-582-9933. Back after these messages.